Scotland and Wales take the field together at Ninian Park Cardiff for their traditional annual duel that draws 60,000 fans. The home team kick off and straight away they're on the attack. Trevor Ford, number nine, clashes with George Young, the Scots captain, and it's a corner. Outside left, Roy Clark takes it for Wales. Young Derek Tapscott and goalie Willie Fraser fight it out. Fraser is making his international debut in this match. Now it's the turn of Willie Waddle, who baffles the Welsh defence as he hustles upfield. An anxious moment, but Alf Sherwood kicks it behind. Nearly a goal that time. And the Scotsmen don't let the Welsh defenders relax. And again, it's Alf Sherwood who saves the Welsh bacon. Scotland sweep back once more. Ring centres, but Buckley doesn't connect. Another lucky escape. With Scotland taking most of the honours, half-time comes around. There's still no score, so Wales set out to do something about it. Tapscott, the young Arsenal inside right centres. Davidson, who's playing a great game, helped avert that spot of trouble. But here comes some more. This time, Cunningham deals with it by flicking back to the goalie. Scotsman Ring takes over. Last season, he was top scorer for Clyde, and this is his international debut. Ring comes back into the picture as he centres. Goalie Kelsey can't reach it, and Paddy Buckley is there to head it into the Welsh net. With Scotland leading 1-0, Wales go all out for the equaliser. John Charles, number five, puts in good service at centre-half, but with only a few minutes left to play, he's moved up to centre-forward. But the Welshmen, who'd hoped this year to gain their first post-war win at Ninian Park, didn't pull the game out of the fire. Scotland win by one goal to nil.